finally back with a new video. It has been two months, which has been a little bit too long, but I got so many views on my closet tour video that I made, I think like probably a year ago, that I wanted to do a favorite clothing slash accessory video because I get asked so many times where I get all my clothes. I try to tag everything on Instagram. But sometimes um, I just don't have the links to them and obviously I don't have enough followers on Instagram to do the little swipe up thing. I brought a bunch of clothes that I love. Very colorful vibe right now. This video is also sponsored by Ana Luisa, which is a sustainable jewelry company and they wanted me to show you guys some pics that I made. If I can find them, where'd they go? Let me find, give me one second. Where'd they go? I just had them. This is not good. Basically, I made some pics and they're having a they're having a Mother's Day sale, which is so amazing. Um, which is why I'm posting this literally on the Wednesday before Mother's Day, so you guys can get it in time. As long as you guys order by today, May 5th, you'll get it by May 9th. Or if you live internationally, you have to buy it by May 3rd, but it's past May 3rd. But still, they are having a sale, so you guys should go check them out. Also, it's really hot in SF right now, so I'm like sweating. Okay. So they do have really, really, really good quality necklaces. They came in little pouches, they're little velvet pouches. I love it. And if you guys have been watching my videos for a super long time, you'll know that I can't wear fake jewelry. So I literally wear their heart locket necklace all the time. Also found out that my brother bought his girlfriend one, so we have a matching one now. And the sale is gonna be 15% off all products on their website. So this is the first one. So I feel like a beauty guru. Is it focusing? Ah. Okay, so it's this little like hand with a little, I think it's so cute. And then there's this forget-me-not. I've been wanting a small staple necklace for so long. Focus. Um, And she has a little flower. It's so cute. I love it. It's a perfect gift, especially because they're not super expensive. They start from $39 and up. And I will also leave a link in the description below so you guys can go check them out with my discount code and the link so you guys can shop through there. I love stacking my necklaces. Obviously, I wear them to sleep. Sleep, so I also shower with them <laughs> so they get super knotted and I always forget to like fix them which is hence why they look like this on my neck so I'm gonna show you guys some of my favorite accessories which are these and just Aunt Louise necklaces in general and how I style them plus my current favorite clothes because that's gonna be really really fun so obviously I don't know if you can see this very colorful vibe I also didn't grab my dresses off of my dress rack which is right behind you and also my vanity is a mess but that's my dress rack but I'm gonna show you guys what I chose from my actual closet which is on that side which is skirts tops jackets all that jazz first off I got this super cute I am gonna say this again I'm really into colors I got this super super cute halter tank two days ago at Zara Oh, it was like 12, it was like 9, 12? Uh, this one was like 12.90, which honestly isn't that bad. It, it's super cute. Sorry, they're doing construction in the back, so if you can't hear me, that's why. But this is such a cute top. I love how it has a ring. It's green, because green is my favorite color right now, if you haven't noticed, based on my Instagram feed. Also got this Zara top. I've been shopping at Zara a lot. I don't know why. It's a little bit different, but it kind of gives the same vibe. <laughs> Um, it just doesn't have like the o-ring on the top and it's not like a tie halter this one's like an actual tank top this one was 990 a little bit cheaper it also has a little thing on it but it looks like this super cute honestly i think these with this would be a vibe gold goes good with everything in my opinion i do not like silver. Also from Zara, I got this blue tank top. This one was a little bit more expensive. It was like $25.90, but the color guys is so pretty. Obviously the color, the color obsession right now is very big, but you can button it all the way up, which I honestly never do. Or you can make it like a little top collared top. If you just don't button it all the way, it'll like flap over very cute love it also on that day i bought funny enough you will honestly probably never see me in shorts but i found a pair of shorts that i was like kind of vibey so i bought these 
what are those? These jorts. Um, thought it would be very cute. Um, I had to cut them a little bit because I have short legs and they were just almost down to my knees. So let's laugh. And then this could go with it vibe with these vibe. Oh, immaculate. I love it. And then next, I also bought this a while ago, but I've never worn it. Okay, I've been also really into tie dye and I just don't know why. I got this pink tie dye skirt from Glass Ons. Too big for me, but I think it was like the smallest size on their website but it is a little big and it's a little short so I just need to figure out how to style it or like make it smaller in the waist so I could actually wear it but I love mixing color combinations like pink and green and orange and yellow orange and pink vibe got this top from cool as a construct orange mesh very cute I put it on Instagram the other day so yeah I got this and I also bought this which is their baby tee and it's green because guess what? We love green in this house. Love this, love these so much. And then from Tiger Mist, I've also been really loving Tiger Mist recently. It's this halter top. Oh my God, it like cinches on the sides. Let me figure this out because there are many strings on this top. Okay, whoa, that's not right. Okay, there we go. So it looks like this. I also wore it on my Instagram. Definitely one of my faves. Basically, they tie at the top behind your neck, obviously. It's like a meshy, double mesh material with side ties. I got a size extra small, fits me well. I used to also never wear black, but I've been really getting into it recently. But I also really love prints. So I got this skirt from Princess Polly. Oops, I think this is one of my favorites. It kind of gives me zebra vibes, but also like another animal. I don't know why, but it's like not a normal zebra print, which I love. And it's not like white, it's like beige and brown. Serve also got this cheetah one. I have been wanting this for so long and I finally like caved in and bought it because I never really had a cheetah skirt that I loved. So here's this one, it's basically the same. And then let's go to Urban Outfitters because God knows I buy way too much stuff there, but I'm just gonna show you guys my favorite thing that I bought because I work there, so I shop there too much. I know that there have been so many people obsessing over their corsets and it's very, very reasonable. Here is this corset. It's one of my favorites. It's like brown with black polka dots. I love it. I got it in a size small and the only thing that's like iffy about it is like the dots are velvet but like they came off. They come off because when you rub against it I guess. So just look out for that. Still very cute. Oh also from Princess Polly. Got this skirt. I don't wear it very often but it's tie-dye as I said I freaking love tie-dye. You could like wear it straight across. It's a green tie-dye which by the way, it makes it 10 times better. Or you can like cinch it, and so it goes like a little V at the top. Love this skirt though, I think it's so cute. I just don't have places to wear it. Love green. Another green product. This is my House of Sunny Paradise top. I got it in a size, where's the tag? This is not going well. Also, there's construction going on as I said, so that is all the noise if you hear it. Oh, there's the tag. It is a size US2. This is she i need to button the sides but i'm too lazy to do that so it's like a halter love the uh, material i think my boobs are too small for it but that's okay they'll grow one day maybe here's it upside down because i'm just like too lazy to actually do it this dress is from marmal who small business love it kind of looks like the with jean dresses oh my god i really need to like button my stuff for you guys because i feel like this is just not going very well I also have class in like 20 minutes, so, oh, 30 minutes, 40 minutes, so we're good on time. So this is her, very cute. I had to hem her a little bit because obviously I'm kind of short. Also terry cloth, I am obsessed with terry cloth right now. I don't know why, don't ask why, I just love it. Okay, so Enduring Kairos is a, I think that's how you pronounce it, I hope so. It is a brand that I found on Depop and I bought two things from them, but this is like my all-time favorite. It's like the IMG skirt, but like better because it's longer and cuter. So I know that IMG has like a, an orange version of their like Cersei skirt. I don't really know if that's how you pronounce it, but this is so cute. Also very stretchy and I bought the matching top for it, but my boobs, don't, I guess my boobs are too big for them, which is like weird. One of my favorite skirts though, super cute. This is my House of Sunny Peggy Cardi. I had 
the yellow one when it first came out, but like it wasn't cropped and I didn't know how to style it. And now a ton of people are styling it. So I sold mine on Depop. So this is the green one. I freaking love it because obviously I love green. The fur is detachable, which makes it better, but I never detach it because I have other green cardigans that I can wear. But this is definitely one of my go-tos if I just need to put on a sweater and look like I'm put together. And then I know that I mentioned this in my last, oh my god, I have so many hangers on my bed right now, in my last closet tour. And I said that I didn't really like it, but I freaking love it. <laughs> like I've been wearing it so much more recently and I love it. It is one of my all-time favorite tops. It is my Realization Par Kaya um, top. It is very thin but it's cute. And I just love the fit of it. I love it, I love it, I love it. And then lastly, this skirt, I also have a Tiger Mist skirt. I don't know where it is. It's a skirt that I wore the other day and everyone was asking me where I got it from. Bought this a while ago from Zara and I never wore it because I was like, how would I wear this? So it is a skirt. It has, it kind of looks like a business skirt, which is just like, eh, to me. But I wore it to work the other day and it was so nice because the back guys are shorts, number one. So it's a skirt. But like some of the skirts that I wear are too short for me and then I can't do anything. So this is a very cute Zara skirt that I love. If you can find it, you should totally get it. It's also very thick material, but that's all for my tops. And then I'll move over to my cardigan bag and dress closet. So let's go over there. This is my dress cardigan um, vibe. <laughs> I know I have a lot and these are my go-to like my higher-end bags that I've bought this one I got from my friend my friend's friend for like 275 and then this one I got on the real real it's like my go-to I freaking love it it's kind of small but definitely a fave yeah it's so cute and it's brown suede not really a fan of suede but Still a vibe, I love it. I also have this Marc Jacobs purse um, that I bought on The Real Real. It looks like this, it's like fuzzy, which makes it 10 times better than, than it not being fuzzy. But it is a little bit bigger, so if I need it to go anywhere, I'd probably bring this one. Um, and this clothing rack is very sturdy. It's from Target. This is the heaviest bag I've ever owned in my entire life. Let me take it off though. So, starting off, let me show you guys some of the faves. Now, I have a lot of dresses. Also, these clips are from Shein. Uh, okay. Oh, my God. So I haven't picked anything out yet, so you guys are just gonna watch me pick some of my favorite things. What things that I've been wearing a lot recently? Oh, I also bought that purple dress from Marmel in white, but okay, so, ooh, I saw that coming. All right, let's go with, oh! Uh, so I got this Elton John collection dress. I should have got it in an extra, extra small because it's a little bit too big. I also, oh my God, there's no way. Okay, so I told you guys that I didn't fit this right. So I have to close pin this thing. I have messed up the silk on this and that makes me really sad. So maybe I might have to go like get it like done because I think I ripped a hole in it. I don't know how to fix that. So I might have to go get that fixed. Next. Okay, so I also just got this dress on sale because I can't afford regular Vanessa Mooney dresses. That's a little bit expensive. So this one was on sale. When they said neon green, they really meant neon green, but I love it. It has a little bow on the back and you can make it like not a halter, but I just love the halter. I wish I could have gotten it in like white or anything, but the white wasn't on sale. But yeah, I really wanted to just try their stuff out. Wrinkles very easily. So keep that in mind if they still have that on their website. Um, and then the but the beginning boutique. Let's talk about this dress. I've talked about it so many times, but like, come on. I don't know how to show you guys what this what this looks like. Okay, this is gonna look absolutely hilarious, but it basically is green and blue. It goes like that. And I love it. The only problem is it doesn't really fit me and my boobs fall out of it 24 seven. So maybe size up in this if you need it you don't want your boobs falling out of it that's just not a vibe also the back is open obviously as we all know miss img probably one of my favorite dresses of all time look at just oh. they were on something when they created this print it has a little open side one shoulder and 
I love it. I just think it's so cute. My friend Riley has it and she said she looked like a Flintstone, but I freaking love this dress. I also bought it on sale because IMG at a sale. It's really hard to talk to you guys while looking through my closet. But okay, I bought this dress from Tiger Mist. It looks like this. It has a little open here under the boobies. Halter, O-ring. And it's bl uh, black and it's chocolate brown. Oh, I got this from Zara. Super cute, I bought it the same day that I bought those other two tops, the green and the pink one. And she looks like this. I obviously am obsessed with this whole like triangle vibe in the front. It's green and you know I love green. Also, this dress that I'm wearing now, it's from H&M and I bought it for $17. I think it's really cute. I have to cut it because it's a little bit too long on me. But she looks like this and I bought it in orange in terry cloth. It's in the wash right now. This dress is so cute. I wish I would have maybe gotten a size bigger. And I also have this green and pink one. I wore it once and I had a lot of problems with my boobs falling out of it. I don't know. I feel like it's like a reoccurring theme in all my clothes that my boobs just fall out of everything. So I was gonna sell it and then I tried it on again and I like tied the straps hoping that that would do something. So maybe I'll wear it out again and just hope my boobs don't fall out of it and we'll see how that goes. Oh, and it's from Beginning Boutique and I got it in a size four. I feel like I showed you guys most of my like other stuff in my other video, I think. But um, if you guys like look on, like I don't really wear any of those bags over there. Okay, so these jeans, everyone has been obsessed with them. They were all over TikTok for a quick minute, I think. But they're just the Zara jeans. Love them, these are my favorite jeans of all time. I had to cut them, but they were like frayed on the bottom anyways. But these are my favorite jeans ever. I wish I still had the tags so I could show you guys or tell you guys what the item number was, but I don't really know. I'll have to find that. I will also show you guys my sunglasses because the amount of people that ask me about my sunglasses is hilarious because I wear them 24 seven. So let's move over to my little sunglasses area down there. Here I am. Hey guys. So here we have the beautiful Anna Louisa necklaces. I finally stuck them on my little necklace holder. And then I took off all the necklaces that I don't wear, which is everything, so. There are my sunglasses. This is still not focusing. Ah uh, yes, hello. So pretty. So I'm gonna show you guys my sunglasses because they are my favorite part of my wardrobe. I'm missing a pair, I don't know where they are, but I just bought them from Urban. Okay, so these ones are my all-time favorites. They look like this. They're from Urban, absolutely where I shop all the time. They are like brown orange, um, and the lenses are super lightly tinted. These ones are also from Urban, they're green. Sometimes I don't wear them all the way up because I look really funny in them, but sometimes I feel like a real baddie, like Bella Hadid. So these ones are from Urban as well. Oh, we also have my heels down here. I could show you guys my heels actually because I want to and I feel very nice. So as you guys know, these are my all time favorites. I just don't know what I would do without them. They are brown, platform, Jeffrey Campbell's. <sighs> They're like bronze. Super, super freaking cute and easy to walk in. I also have them in the purple color, which makes me love them 10 times more. They're purple and pink. I'm gonna probably wear them on tour. These ones are from Nasty Gal. I will probably never wear them, but they're so gorgeous. They remind me of Cinderella. Okay, well, I just did a really horrible job at organizing this whole video. But I hope you guys did enjoy my little closet favorites because I love filming stuff about my clothes. I do buy everything myself because I do have three jobs. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to click the link down below to go check out Anna Luisa because I know you guys want to go shop from them so bad. I know I do and I just love them. Sorry about the mess of the necklaces. Yeah, this is just not vibey. Um, but thank you again for watching and the link down below is for 15% off. And let me know if you guys want anything else. I know I always tell you guys that and I never film anything, but I will very much be filming a room tour video very soon for you guys because that is my re most requested video of all time. But thank you guys again and I will see you guys next time. I love you.